We're here to describe the action for you. Nice to have you with us, Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith. Sheffield Wednesday today versus Norwich City. Let's look at Sheffield Wednesday and the list of their players here. It does look more like 4-4-1-1 than 4-4-2. Yes, I think so. I mean, it gives the manager the option of stiffening his midfield. And when they get the ball, you know that... To take the lead! The big hitters have hit again. They go in front and with their attacking prowess. No one's surprised here. It's just a matter of who's going to score the goals. You know they are going to score. And they've got so many different ways of breaking down the opposition. That's the reward for putting the ball into the area from a good cross and finished very well. Well, as a former centre forward, I love to see those kind of balls swinging into the box. Magnificent. Okay, now that's a throw. And they've spread it out wide here. Tim Krul. Well, you have to go back to the 1920s to find the real golden era of Huddersfield Town. And what a club they were getting on for a century ago. But at the moment, the current team are battling, and the league table reflects that. Well, I had them down as title challengers. I can't believe where they are. Bananas! And it's gone for a corner. Short corner designed to move the opposition around in the middle. Keeper not taking any chances, not wanting to catch that one. He's punched it away, probing the pass. Trying to run off the shoulder of the last player, offside. That is a weakness in his game. Gets caught offside too many times. Kenya. Going for goal! It's a goal on that level. Well, for a fraction of a second, Alan, I thought he was going to keep it out. He did get a touch on the ball, the goalkeeper, but in it went. Yeah, he's annoyed with himself there. He's his own harshest critic and he feels he should have done better. It is... Uh... Level, both sides have scored here now. With great vision here. Defended well. Sometimes, uh, certainly in uh, days gone by, and a way draw was seen as a, a good result. I think most teams go to try and win the matches. They've drawn their last three, the visiting team today. Yeah, they have. I mean, they've been solid defensively. They're quite an organised side, which will help them here on the travels. Kenya. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. Not rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. You can see what he was trying to do. Put the defender in the way. Well, that's gone behind. It'll be a corner. And in it goes. Well, that's good defending. Possession is the name of the game for this team. He's tried that from... Well, he got the power from that range. That was pretty good, but not the accuracy. Yeah, if you try from that distance, you've got to do a better job than that. On the move and able to cut out the pass. He's given it away. Kenya. A chance to break away now on the counter. And find some space here on the flanks. To whip it in now. Sheffield Wednesday man is uh, penalised here. It's definitely a yellow in the mind of the referee, definitely. Well, I think it unquestionably was. I mean, on another day, he might have got a red for that. It was a really dangerous challenge. Good interception. Goodness, they needed him then to clear that.
that is a free kick. And they've got a chance to really make the most of that decision. Well, this is a really good opportunity to take the lead. Off the crossbar and back into the penalty area. And that's really the way to get the ball out of the danger zone. So close to taking the lead there, but the woodwork denying them. Just got to keep playing the way they are. Playing some good stuff at the moment. And the referee says, free kick. Cleared away by the defender. Palmer. Shreds it through. In with a chance. Delivered into the box. Goal, they've taken the lead here. They go in front with this very slick attack. And however the opposition sets up against them, they have the power to break them down. It's really exciting, it's really entertaining. And as you've seen, yet again, it's really effective. Sheffield Wednesday with the lead. a bit too hard trying to force the pass and it went to, straight to an opponent Pena got the opposition back pedaling a little bit shots off that's a good block oh it's a corner by that deflection Corner played into the middle. This could be the leveller. Good defensive clearance there. Hernandez. Hernandez. It's a very good interception. work really to read the intention of the pass into the box it goes along the ground and he can clear it here probing the pass could whip it in from here that's a good header very close actually hit the frame of the goal yeah oh got an oof from the crowd that one Kenya. And the added time will amount to three minutes at least. Three minutes of added time. Probing away, trying to find room for a shot, maybe. Opportunity to cross it now. Hernandez! Oh, that would have looked great if it had flown in, but in the end it didn't fly very close at all. No, he looked a bit embarrassed after that effort. McKay. but can maybe think about starting the attack. Half time now, and 2-1 is the score at the break. Not often, Alan, do you see one man have one half like he's had. Seemed to be all over the pitch in that first half, and he was in the box when it mattered to grab himself a couple of goals. His team can certainly be thankful for his performance and for their lead. have hit again they go in front and with their attacking prowess no one's surprised here <laughs> 45 minutes to go as we start the second half good screening and he's kept the ball.
Pena. Good challenge here. Palmer. Now, can he take them on? That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. Safety first there. Palmer. Closer. He's pointed for the free kick. Closer. He's got his shot off now. Saw the ball, went for it. Pulls it back now. Out in front of goal. Got to pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress. Giving it straight away. Marco Stiepermann. The referee has awarded this free kick. He's normally good from these set plays and uh, his teammates are expecting a good ball in. Put in with a bit of whip. Cleared it well. Norwich City's next game, Alan. Well, they're playing Charlton Athletic in their next match in the Championship. And, uh, Incisive pass. Has to score. And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Deciding to go for it and bring on a new player. And in it goes. Good defensive clearance there. Can the okay. Of the red and they get it away. SMUG1, We've had an hour gone here. It's still 30 minutes left. Opening them up with a through pass. Kenya. With great vision here. He's in. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. I see a substitute coming on for the away team here. Well, the manager not wasting any time here. He's going to make the change. And they are going to try and turn this around. Far too close across to the keeper. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Space to try and hit it now. Here's a chance, the goalkeeper exposed. Marco Stiepermann. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. Ben Marshall. It's an excellent cross. Played away, well away from goal. And shoots! Corner kick for... Norwich City, the team that's behind at the moment. Put the corner in the middle. Close that! So close with that header. Oh, he's good at that, isn't he? He really does connect well with those neck muscles. Well, here's an opportunity with the ball over the top. Pena. Hernandez. Leitner. Pass threaded through. He wants to play on the shoulder of the last defender. He's just got to get it right. It's all about timing. Looking for teammates in the middle. Well, they're waltzing through again. So much attacking confidence. Another goal. They're two up now. 
all the prospects here are of more goals to come. They're the most exciting team that you could ever wish to watch, and they never really disappoint you. They make chances, but most importantly, they take their chances. Their efficiency in front of goal is phenomenal. 3-1 the scoreline as we restart the game. Time ticking on. Just over 15 minutes to go. Cut out the pass. Moritz Leitner. Hernandez. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. Marco Stiepermann. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. And that's a turnover in play. Played in the clear. And in the shot, goal! That's a very good goal. Well, they've got a goal, and that will mean a bit to the players, particularly the scorer and maybe the manager of the team. Well, that's made it more interesting now. The difference is only one. Well, this is the team with all the momentum. And I'll be hoping now to go on and score another. Well, plenty of goals here today, 3-2. The noise levels have gone up even more. And the scenario remains the same, the one goal lead. And we're into the last ten minutes. By well, the way things are shaping up, it looks like the home team are going to see out this lead, but still a chance for things to change. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Or it's like Puki. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went to straight to an opponent. The board has gone up to indicate three added minutes. Three minutes of added time. Well, he's playing it back to the goalkeeper. It's all over. 